Now, movement on the far side. There's numbers in there for South Africa. The header on goal. Wave off the wave of attack has led to the pressure finally taking his toll on Seychelles and a knife to the heart. Moulin, Hira! 2 0. Powering in is a Satchwayo. Quality on the ball in from Madiba. South Africa now beginning to find the mark. 27 year old Kamala Mokocho looking to get in. Oh, no, the goals then for Bafana. This is a strong play. Now, Matiba! 3 0. Clack, clack. Bang! Top corner, top draw. Well, before this match got underway, it was coming down with rain. Now that the rain has stopped, it's raining goals and it's all Bafana, Bafana. Dao on the move. Dao! Beats the defender, beats the keeper! And finally. Finds the back of the net. It's beautifully done with the run then and the touch from Motiba in getting the assist, the composure and brilliance by Percy Tao roaring as he finds that fourth. In fact, in the last 12 games, is uh, just two matches they haven't lost. That win over Lesotho and just before that, a 1 1 scoreline against Ethiopia. Every other game they've lost. Now, here is Dino Lobo. Not to be denied. South Africa 5. Initially, I thought man, there might have been a touch of offside from Udovu, but this one clearly shows it that he was onside. Ta-da! One more for the road. Six. That's Mugwena gets his first a senior level. That's a big moment for the youngster. Took it well. Very well. You see, that's what helps. If you got a Mokocho, okay, Femin is out. But uh, this youngster obviously railing the opportunity. There's not a lot of pressure. This one was missing, I think, quite a bit. I mentioned the two midfielders, Mokosha, and they played a little bit higher. They find themselves in a situation where they could score. But he took it further by getting into the box and spating the movement. Quality in between the two central defenders. Whoa, a quality header. Okay, it starts from the cross as well. Pace with which it's played in. Very difficult for the defenders to adjust to the flight.